In this series, we're going to be talking about the mid backhand area of the court just because I think it is the area where most of the game is played. You try to dig your opponents back in the deep corners and then you want to follow it up with a good volley or not necessarily volley but just from the mid section you want to take time away from your opponent to be able to keep the pressure on and dominate the tee area. And to do so there are so many ways to do it because it depends on really the shot, the quality of shot your opponent is playing and your quality of shot prior to that as well. So if you're playing a, a good length uh, in the back deep corners, whether here or there, you're leaping towards the backhand side because you feel that he's gonna hit a cross court from there or a straight drive from there. So you leap onto that and we're gonna talk about all the different scenarios. I think you have, there are four main scenarios that I haven't had. Obviously during the match there are different ones, but the four main ones are when you have a loose shot played by your opponent, you want to step off the tee and take the ball early to take time away from your opponent and you want to go with your right leg and we'll talk more about it, why with your right leg rather than the left one. If your opponent has hit a decent shot and nearer to the side hole, you want to, to make it shorter and faster for yourself, you want to go with your left leg and then come back again. And then if your opponent has hit a high, a high straight drive or a high lob, cross court lob from the other side, you want to go backwards and with either leg, whatever you decide, this one or that side, still facing the side hole, and hit a straight drive again. And then if your opponent has hit a pretty short drive or a short cross court, you wanna be able to use your left leg to play a half volley, and we'll talk more again about it in detail.